Have you heard of the self-righteous narcissist? The self-righteous narcissist is a term coined by Dr. Romney several years ago. It's a type of narcissist that you would describe as rigid, pompous, and holier than thou. These types of narcissists are oftentimes workaholics, but it's not like just somebody who has to have a lot of jobs because of the economy very emotionally cold and distant because they have so much work. You'll hear things like, I work so much harder than everybody else. What did you do all day? And even though they're making a lot of money and they could help others, they tend to be extremely stingy. So if their sister has a huge medical emergency, instead of saying, oh, I'll help you pay for the surgery, they'll say, well, with your health insurance, you're gonna have to wait four months and that's on you. I've always told you to get a better job. These people are very judgmental. They think that they're better than everyone. They think that they're too smart to get therapy. They think that they're perfect. If they see another couple getting a divorce, they might say something like, well, they are defying their holy vows so we can't hang out with them anymore. If you grew up with a self-righteous narcissist as a parent, your household was very cold. You weren't allowed to have your own emotions and feelings. The self-righteous narcissist might've told you that mental health issues don't really exist. You're not allowed to get therapy because that's only for quacks or all these other very pompous, outdated views, which are basically meant to dehumanize you and make you feel bad for being a human, being a child, making mistakes. You would have also heard a lot of things like, I work so hard and other kids have it worse. What are you crying for? Stop doing that. But at the same time, you were constantly being judged in your house, making you have to walk on eggshells around this parent from a very young age. Like if you messed up even one time, they were just gonna disown you or not love you anymore. A lot of people mistake the self-righteous narcissist for somebody who's just like very rigid or has OCD, but if they have a dinner planned at six o'clock and you can't get there until 6.15 because there's traffic, the self-righteous narcissist will say, well, we already ate dinner, you should be on time next time. They don't give you any room to make mistakes. They're constantly criticizing you. They're constantly making you feel like you're below them, like everyone is below them. If you need help recovering from a self-righteous narcissist, you can email me for remote narcissistic abuse recovery coaching. My email's in my bio.